New today in the case against Casey, more doubts about her defense's claim. They've uncovered more than a dozen new witnesses. Those witnesses will reportedly support the defense claim that someone other than Casey put her daughter's remain in the woods. Now, West 2's Bob Killing broke the story after Anthony's court hearing Monday. And Bob, much of the skepticism has to do with how the defense can know where these people claim to have searched. Well, that's right, Jim. Attorney Cheney Mason surprised us by saying that they've uncovered 15 to 20 new witnesses. But the problem with that is, if those people were not exactly sure where they searched along that long, densely wooded stretch of Suburban Drive. Their claims may be easily discounted. Arguably the biggest development from Casey Anthony's Monday court appearance came after defense attorney Cheney Mason telling West 2 they've identified more than a dozen new volunteer searchers who worked independently of Texas EquiSearch who say they looked in the woods where Kaylee Anthony's remains were later found and nothing was there, supporting the defense's theory that someone other than Casey put them there. And I think we were 15 or 20 so far that are exactly on the spot, and there was nobody there. Because it all boils down to how do you define that exact spot? Defense attorney Richard Hornsby says it would be difficult for these alleged new witnesses two years after they searched to know exactly where they were. Until these people give uh, very specific uh, recounts of where they were and what they did, you really have to take anything they say with a grain of salt. And it remains to be seen how many of these people will be subpoenaed by Mason and the defense team to testify about what they saw or didn't see. I highly doubt he found anybody that said that they were in that exact spot. And until he presents a witness list and those people actually are under oath and say that, I, I would... Uh, be very questionable with anything he claims. Mason tells West 2 he will present his witness list to the judge Friday. And also late today, the Anthony defense team filed a motion asking Judge Belvin Perry to once again approve more additional hours of investigation. And many of those hours have already been spent by their investigators seeking out and questioning dozens of people who claim to have searched along Suburban Drive. Jim. Bob, thanks so much.